everyone and welcome to another episode of Dogcraft. My name is Stacy and I'm joined as always by the Minecraft versions of my real life pets, Paige, Molly, Polly, Milk Toast, and Pipsqueak. Hi Paigey. Thanks for coming out to the balcony for the intro. <clears throat> Polly and everyone else who left. Oh, I think Pipsqueak. <laughs> Pipsqueak just teleported onto the tree down there. You're going to go Oh wait, Molly, you are here. I'm sorry, Molly. Look at you sunning yourself. <gasps> I owe you an apology. I'm sorry. You were here for the intro right on time. Uh, it was Polly that... <gasps> Do you know what? You guys, we were so close. Oh my gosh. We were so close to a perfect intro. We had Paige, Molly, and Polly. I don't think that's ever happened. We were just missing the cats. Where's Milk Toast? Milk? I don't... I hear him. Anyway, oh, hi, Pippi. All right, so let's go ahead and get going with today's episode. I am going to be showing off the finished raccoon recycling center. There's one more thing. Oh, I heard an Enderman. There's one more thing that we have to build there. You know, I never noticed what a beautiful... Molly, why are you on the kitchen sink? I never noticed what a beautiful view we have of the cathedral here from our kitchen window. That's lovely. Um, anyway, there's one more thing that we have to build at the Raccoon Recycling Center. And then I also need to keep looking a little bit more for Perp. Uh, ah, he's in our house! He's in our house! <gasps> We've never had an Enderman visit us in our house before. Sir? What did you take? What block is that? I can't tell. It's it's like not showing up. What block of my house did you take? Wow. Oh, it's, a, it's just a piece of dirt. Hi, sir. I feel like I should name tag you and you should stick around. Uh, you're not Noel, but maybe you're Noel's cousin? Ah! I looked at him, 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 I looked at him. Wolves! 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 Help me! Why'd the cat stand up? Oh, no, okay, that, that was weird. Um, guys, there's an Enderman, and- Ow! He's teleporting in here! Guys, uh, stand up! Defend me against the Enderman if he teleports back in, okay? I've got my wolf pack now. I doubt that he will make a play at me. I need to eat. I'm gonna die. Uh, okay. Well, that was exciting. I guess he's not gonna be our friend. Uh, now that we're down here, I suppose we should go ahead and see which wolf is going to accompany us on our adventures today. Uh, it's going to be Wink! Hey! Wink, you haven't come in a while. All right, there you go, Wink. And then, let's see here, I guess, Wink, you will just have to be my protector. Do I have a stick on me? I never have a stick on me anymore. I used to have an actual, like, dedicated stick. Uh, that's how you can change the dog so that they follow you. Um, but I don't know where it, where it went. All right, Wink, you're set to follow. Uh, Milk Toast and Pippi, you guys can just stay here for now. Uh, because I guess we will go choose a cat. Because technically, we're still building something. Everest, you can go ahead and sit down up there. <laughs> Silly Everest. He has to go up somewhere high, no matter where he is. Uh, okay, Wink, you'll teleport. And if the Enderman teleports, you'll get him, right? Uh, okay, let's see which cat is coming with us. But I think it's going to be you, Millie. All right, it is Milk Toast. What? What? <laughs> I thought that Millie was the only one. Oh, did Milk Toast and Pipsqueak have a, a thing in there too? Okay, I'm sorry, Millie. Maybe next time. Looks like it's gonna be Milk Toast today. All right, Milky Boy, you can come with me. <laughs> Milk and Wink. Uh, all right, sorry, Millie. I'm so sorry. All right, we need. Oh, you know what? I need redstone actually. Ooh, and let's get rid of this potion of poison that I had. Oh, you know what? I need this enchantment table. Uh, if any of these potions would come in handy for the rescue expedition, we should start packing. Splash potion of poison. Splash potion of harming. Okay, here's the redstone that we need. We don't even need that much. Uh, we don't even probably need, well, we'll bring this much. Where did my backpack go? That's what I needed to start packing for the rescue expedition. Did I leave it upstairs? Well, we might as well go upstairs anyway and sleep because it's night. Uh, and I can look, hi Paige. I can look to see if I put my backpack in here. Where did I put my backpack? Oh, do you know what? I bet it's at the build site. I bet it's there. Okay, I'm gonna sleep. Good night, everybody. Oh, Wink, you're stuck. You're glitched in the desk by my typewriter. Are you okay? You did not look well. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and go over 
uh, to the build site and I will show you guys what I, oh no wait, the art gallery. Okay, hold on. Let's look at the pictures we've received since the last episode of Dogcraft. I found a second raccoon. I got attacked by a green chicken. Uh, Nico enjoyed the leaf pile. Paige couldn't stop eating. And Zephyr randomly teleported to me. Now this next illustration is actually from my second book. This is me holding Paige on a pumpkin on a wolf. My book comes out on April 9th. Links in the description below. I'm also going on book tour. Okay, I guess we're going out this way now. That's unusual. Uh, oh, hello, little baby. Little baby Pollux, how are you? So let's go ahead and come this way. We can use the brand new Pages Path that I still need to actually change the sign on it because I named it Pages Lane, but it's Pages Path. This pig is a long way from the pig pen. Um, hmm, you should really be up here with, oh, with these guys. Oh dear, this is a bit of a problem here. Oh my gosh, how many pigs is this? This is insane. Um, okay, let's see. Can I use a water bucket to like flush some of you guys out or something? Um, what if I put a block? Uh, do I just have glass? Okay, I've got silk touch, that's okay. If I put a block like up here and then put water like here, will it wash all of you? No, that didn't work at all. That was, that was horrible. I'm gonna have to break the fence, but I know that all the pigs will come rushing out. Um, hmm. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's take some of these fences up here. Let's take the second level of these. Did I just hit a pig? I didn't just hit a pig, did I? Wink, do not kill a pig. Okay, and there we go. I am being so careful right now. All right, I'm just gonna extend. Oh no, 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 no. Uh, I'm just gonna extend it. No, 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 pig, no. No, 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 no. Oh gosh, oh no, they're all getting out. They're all getting out. No, 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 no. Okay, hold on, there, there. Wink, move, wink, wink, move. I'm sorry, um, okay, there, and then uh, there, there, and oh gosh. This is just a mess now. It was this one. I shouldn't have ever messed with that fence right there. Okay. All right. Now you're just you're free. <laughs> go ahead and get on with your life. All right. There we go. Now I can get rid of these fences in here, and hopefully this is gonna free up all these pigs. Oops, not that one. There we go. All right. You're free. You guys are free. Here. Okay. I really don't want to hit a pig right now. Oh gosh, not that one. Uh, this one right here. There we go. All right. All better. And <laughs> you just have to make your way out. You got stuck in the water, huh? All right. You guys are all free now. So just you know, space out. Oh, is this Ryder? Uh, no, you are an unnamed pig with a saddle. Where's the fence gate here? Isn't, oh, it's over here. Okay. All right. That was a fun little distraction. I think the same thing is probably happening to my chickens again. Yeah, okay. We're going to have to, like, work this out so that this doesn't keep happening. This is so sad. Okay, that's fine. Is Milk Toast still with us? Okay, perfect. Milk and Wink, my two cute little pets with red collars. All right, you guys... We are coming down Paige's path. This is so exciting. Look at all of the places that we have to build new things. Like we can build something there. We can build something here. I'm excited, but you're about to see the finished raccoon recycling center. I couldn't really build a raccoon face. I think it turned out okay. All right, three, two, one. Here it is. <laughs> Look, you can see like the little raccoon poking out. I'll, I'll ride Zephyr and show you guys like a better view of the build. Um, I think it's cute though. It's just like a little raccoon poking out of the tree. And then if you come in, we've got Nico and Rainy uh, in here. And then I'm gonna build something for them today. Wait, are they here? Oh yes. Hello, Rainy. <gasps> Hello, Nico. How are you? Um, okay, so we're gonna build something, but we're gonna build it. We're gonna build it up on the second level. Hello, Zephyr. I'm not forgetting about you. Is my backpack in this chest? Um, perfect. Yes, it is. So see, I'm already going to start packing for the rescue expedition. Actually, I'm not sure I need bones, but we'll take like the potions, the sleeping bag. I'm going to enchant my stuff later. Uh, okay, perfect. Oh, I have five dispensers in here. Oh, okay. I don't think I need that many. All right. So I think I just need two. Wink. <laughs> uh, oh, Zephyr and Milk Toast. Are you making friends? Um, okay, so let's come up here and I will show you what I want to do. So basically, these trash cans don't work. So I'm going to make a trash and a recycling. Um, and the recycling is sort of just like compost, like it goes to the raccoons. The way that I'm going to do it is I want there to be two chests when you come in. So you're going to come in here and there's going to be like a trash chest and a recycling chest. 
and then oh milk toast that's gonna be complicating uh <laughs> it's not gonna it's not gonna help me very much okay let me see are there we need two signs so that we can mark them down uh i've only got one sign let's make another sign because we have to change this from pages lane to pages path there we go and then now up here we can make our signs um so this one will be i guess this one will be trash and this one will be raccoon recycling all right so then underneath it i'm going to put a dispenser no 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 underneath it, i'm going to put a hopper all right let's drop down here so a hopper goes underneath each of these and then I'm also going to put uh, a dispenser underneath that. So dispenser and dispenser. And then, ooh, this is gonna involve some lava. We may need to shear, so I do not want the whole raccoon recycling center to catch on fire. That would be um, not ideal. So we'll, we'll shear some of these shrubs a little bit. Okay, so, ooh, do you know what? Which chest is which? There was a trapped chest, and I wanted the trapped chest to, oh, I'm not gonna be able to know without breaking the signs. Ugh, okay, is there any way to tell? Oh, yeah, 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 there is a way to tell. So, ooh, did you hear that tick? So if I put a piece of redstone in here, this is the trapped chest, and that's not what I wanted. This is, if I put this redstone in, it's instantly going to go into the hopper and then into the dispenser. Uh, ooh, wait, and into the dispenser. So what I want is I want to switch these. We'll just switch the signs. So this will now, oh, you can see the, look, there's a little piece of redstone right there. Oh, I didn't even notice that ever. Okay, so this one will be trash now. And then this one will be raccoon recycling because now what i'm gonna do is a little bit of redstone if i can remember how to do redstone i'm gonna put a comparator up there can i jump up onto here okay there we'll do some redstone 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 and a repeater whoops i didn't mean to throw out that redstone give me that back redstone repeater Wink, what are you growling at? Is it already nighttime again? It just seems really dark here. There, there. So I'm gonna put redstone, redstone. Oh, it is nighttime. Um, okay, well, we've got a bed up here. Okay, let me see if I can get this redstone to work. I'm gonna be very impressed with myself uh, if I actually can get it to work. Okay, let's go up and see, or we might be able to see from here. If we put a sapling in here, our redstone does not, I think the comparator is the wrong way. Is that right? And then if I put in a sapling, oh yeah, I did it. Oh, I did it. Okay, let's go ahead and then get rid of these leaves. because We don't want any raccoons messing with redstone. Hmm, raccoons and redstone. That sounds like a good title. Let's go ahead then and break this one. So I believe this one now is functional. So what this means is if there's something I want to throw away, say I want to throw away something, but it's something that a raccoon could potentially eat. Like, um, oh, I don't have any rotten flesh on me, I don't think. Let's say I want to throw away a can of Polly's canned dog food. This can of dog food has expired. It is past its prime and I need to just throw it away. But it's a perfectly good can of dog food for a raccoon to still eat. I'm going to throw it into the raccoon recycling. It's already gone. And then look at that. It's on the ground down there. Milk toast. Don't eat that. It's expired. All right. Now we're going to work on the trickier one. This is the trash. This is what the lava is for, and this is what I'm actually very terrified of. Okay, so now we're in here. So these raccoons can just come and grab whatever they want from there. But now we're going to try to do the lava one. Okay, Wink, stand back. Milk Toast, where are you? Milk Toast, sit down up there, please. Don't come anywhere near the lava. All right, there and there. <gasps> I did it! Oh, the raccoons are like, what's happening? Why is there lava? Nico is a little skittish, I've noticed. Okay, I think it's fine. Oh, but that can't be glass. It's gotta be 
Something that I can put redstone on. Oh, I'm silly, Wink. I've made a mistake. Let's bucket the glass back up uh, really quickly. The lava, I meant. Ah, okay, it's gone. <laughs> All right, so that can't be glass. All right, let's go get a different block, but it can't be wood. It's gotta be something that can't burn. I've got cyan stained clay. That'll look really good. Okay, let's use that. Zephyr's like, I don't like the lava. What are you doing? Okay, so this is going to be the comparator. What's the matter? Oh, wink. Here, let me give you some of this expired Polly's food. There you go. You are hungry. All right, let's come up here. Oh gosh, the raccoons are messing with the redstone. Uh, we need a repeater here. And then I think we just need redstone, 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 redstone. All right, so now we can break pretty much all of these other blocks here and this should work now get this away from the lava oh i broke my shears and then we're gonna basically have a block right here i'm gonna put the lava in again and then quickly put the glass there and then break this block here all right this should work now Let's put something that I really don't care about, like maybe just a piece of redstone into the trapped chest. Now, the reason that it's good to use a trapped chest is that if I change my mind, it's like say I accidentally threw the dog defender into there or like, okay, say I really wanted this bucket of milk and I put it in there. It's like, oh no, the bucket of milk. Unless I close the chest and activate the redstone, it's not gonna take it. Whereas in this one that's just going down there, it's just gone. I just put it in and it's gone and it's now down on the ground and the raccoons are now drinking all the milk. Thanks a lot, raccoons. But say I put a piece of redstone in here, I really don't want it. I don't want the raccoons to eat redstone, of course. As soon as I close the chest, then, did you hear it? It's gone and it's in the lava and it's gone forever. Ah! Oh, I did it! I actually did it. You know what, we'll put a piece of glass here. That'll look cool. Kind of like gives you a, like a little peek into the inner workings. Get my bucket of milk back before the raccoons drink it. The lava is there, hopefully. It will not spread and catch on fire. It doesn't look like it's going to. This is so awesome and the raccoons can't get to the redstone, right? No, they can't. All right, perfect milk, you can stand up. You guys, we did it! The raccoon recycling center is finished. I'm so happy. Um, has anyone seen Perp? I don't think I've seen Perp, but basically what I need to start doing now, I feel like, is like looking outside of Dogcraft, right? Outside like the fenced in area. Sir, how are you? Wink, could a little help wink, maybe? Wink, are you serious? Wink, wink. All right, that's okay, I'll take him out myself. Come here, zombie villager. There you go, one more ought to do it. Perfect, thanks for the helmet. Let's see what it has on it. Respiration two, projectile protection four. It's not bad. Oh my gosh. Milk toast. This is why I brought a cat. This is why I brought a cat. Milk, to milk toast, milk toast, milk toast. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, milk toast. You're not gonna help me over there. All right, and fully charged. Nope, it still takes two. Good to know. All right, see, I just got all this gunpowder. I probably don't need gun, or one gunpowder. I probably don't need it. I could throw it away in the recycling center. Um, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and sleep now. And then in the morning, I'm gonna see if I can get Zephyr uh, off of this tree. Don't Stop jumping on the bed, Milk Toast. Uh, are you sitting? I don't, there, sit down. All right, Zeph, I am gonna see if I can stand you up again. And then, can we fly? You are, I'm gonna have to chop down this whole tree. Like you are actually really stuck. Okay, I'm gonna get on you now and then try to walk for, okay, there, we did it, we did it, okay. And fly, Zeph, fly, perfect. Okay, so now I can show you guys the build. I think it blends in with the forest actually really well because of the trees that are on top of it. And then the raccoon's just like a cute little head that's poking out. Let's come over here above this huge tree and then fly around here and get a good look at it. Oh, there it is. How do you go? How do you go down again, Zeph? There you go. There, how cute is this build? I'm so happy with it. All right, Zeph, I guess we should actually just go and fly you back to your house because I don't know how you teleported over to here in the first place. And then sleep. 
Uh, now I have to get all the way back over there to Milk Toast and Wink. Uh, where's the hole? Here it is. Okay, bye Zephyr. And let's go ahead and look a little bit for Perp while we're at it. The thing is, is that sometimes the dogs have like a glitch that happens where they automatically sit down. And if that happened, he could be anywhere. He could be like hiding in some grass. He's very small. He's a dachshund. And he could just be like sitting in a flower and I wouldn't even be able to see him. Uh, now someone mentioned, <gasps> Perp! Oh my gosh, I think we found it. Wait a minute, this is another raccoon. Are you kidding me? Oh, now do I, did I leave the leads over there? I left the leads, all I have are dog leashes. Okay, well, I don't know how you're breathing underwater, but I have a home for you. Um, oh, there, you're above. Thought you were Perp. I got really excited that you were my dachshund. All right, perp, are you over here? thought I saw something over here. Oh, hi, Ms. Reads a lot. Let's come out here. Here's my concern, is that maybe it escaped. Maybe purpose, oh, Squicken, no. You, what, okay, Squicken, be free. If you really wanna be free, now's your chance. Um, Enjoy your life, Squicken. I suppose I should go look in the nether as well. That's like the one place I haven't looked. But I just don't see, Um, uh, what? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's an arctic fox! It's an arctic fox! No way! Hi, hi! Oh, I don't have a leash! Can I give you something? Hi! <gasps> hi! Oh, please be my friend. Okay, you don't have to. Are you gonna kill that chicken? Wow, oh my gosh, okay. All right, well that's cool. Um, make your way over to the Christmas cabin if you want to hang out over there. Well, I'll go into the nether maybe in the next episode and look for perp, but I really don't know who you are and I don't know that if I've named you. I have to still look into all of the ones that I've already named. All right, well, I'll come back for you and I'll probably come back for you actually too. I need to have like some kind of transportation system to get from one end of Dogcraft to the other like really fast. See, this is what I'm talking about. This glitch where they're sitting down now. I didn't sit these guys down. They were all running around. Um, so that's what I think could happen is that Perp could just be sitting down somewhere that I really can't see them. That's the problem. I've got to literally comb through every inch of dog craft. Oh, I just love the raccoon recycling center though. It looks so cute. Uh, all right, wink, milk, come with me. We're actually gonna, oh no, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again. Wink, 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 wink. Actually dying. I'm sorry. Oh gosh, I'm sorry. Chicken, no. Chicken, chicken, why? Why is this chicken so fast? Why is this chicken so fast? Okay, come here with me, chicken, come here. Come here. I'm gonna do something really, really mean. All right, come with me, chicken. I am going to put a block down here and then come up into here. I've never had a zombie chicken before. Ow, you're gonna kill me, zombie chicken. Ow, no, okay, yep, and now up here. Come on in. Yes, yes, zombie chicken. You're inside now. And close the gate. I now have a zombie chicken in with my normal chickens. What should we name the zombie chicken? Let me know in the, where'd he go? Where? Oh, there he is. Okay, cool, he's making friends. Or maybe turning the other chickens into zombies. Let me know in the comments what you think a good name is for a zombie chicken. I kinda like him. Ow, 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 he's he's nice. Um, okay, I guess I'll do this without milk toast and wink, which is probably a terrible idea um, because I'm only wearing diamond boots and a helmet, but this is where I'm thinking. So we have to build a home for the, the baby guest, Gaston. Some people were saying in the nether, I'm also thinking that this could be a really cool area over here. This is like a dark forest. So like, there's no way this path ends right here and then it comes into my nether training facility, but then there's no way to get from the nether training facility back to my home besides going through this incredibly dark, creepy forest where tons of things spawn in. Like, what do you do? You're a baby zombie. You're a bunch of creepers. You're a zombie. This is where I think the perfect home for Gaston will be. So let me know if you have any ideas for what the build could actually be. Um, but I'm gonna go now. But until next time, I will see you guys later. I love you. Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog.